making cheesy biscuits, which I haven't made for a while, but I don't remember all the tweaks that I used to do on them, so I'm hoping they turn out good. But they're going in the oven right now. I didn't think this through. <laughs> also, I already have ribs in there. So they can just scooch on over. Perfect. So here's dinner. Yeah. Chris didn't want a potato, so he potato. Get a one. potato. He doesn't. He didn't get a potato. <laughs> Today I, is Monday. Well, we're welcome, welcome to Monday. <laughs> welcome to Monday. This is leftover from when my parents were here. Yep. And I'm finally getting to it. It was kind of gross, so I cooked it, and I'm hoping it's better now. Oh, well, we put it was our just very barbecue tough. sauce on it. Yeah. Well, the. The ribs weren't that weren't like gross. It was most of the potatoes that weren't so good. They were very tough though. Yeah, they were a little bit tough, but they should be better now that we've you've cooked them in the oven for a little while and Yeah, stuff, I'm thinking so. so. I think they should be alright. Yep, I'm excited. And then cheese biscuits. Mm-hmm. You saw the process of those being made? Have yeah. one. We haven't had these in a really long time. Like a really long time. Mmm. Oh yeah. They're very good. buttery. It's been months, so it's awesome. Never in this apartment. Mm -mm, definitely not. We haven't made these since before our wedding. So. Mm -hmm. so Christopher, in case you guys didn't know, is the best husband in the world, and I love him to death. And look what he got for me today. Aren't they beautiful? He got me pumpkin fall flowers, and they're gorgeous. I love them so much. They're in this pitcher thing. The stems are still right there and half the plant food. So they keep pour half in with water. And then after like a week or something, I'll trim again, dump out water, put the rest of the plant food in so that they last longer. But look how gorgeous they are. Oh, he's the best. I didn't know he was doing it at all. And then he, was, he like walked into the bedroom and I was laying on the bed and it was dark and I just see the silhouette of the beautiful bouquet. <sighs> he's the sweetest ever. Hi. Hi. What you doing? Finding a short story. Yeah? To use. Out of this massive short story science fiction book. Yep. 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 <laughs> I looked and I have that in my cart on Amazon for some reason. This? Like, yeah, before you. Weird. <laughs> before you got it from Steve, so. Yeah. Wow. It's something that I probably would have gotten at some point, so that was funny. I was like, oh, that's weird. I don't even remember putting that in there. Well, I'm, I'm reading a few short stories trying to find one to do for that thing I mentioned a little bit ago. I still haven't done it yet because I haven't found a short story that I want to use. I found a few that I might want to do, but I haven't found one that I want to do, like, first. Yeah. So. That makes sense. I'm going to keep going. Because you want the first one to be the best one. Well, I want it. I want it to be interesting. You want it to be good. <laughs> yeah, I'm hoping hoping I can find something. I would love to do film it this week, maybe, and get it posted soon. Yeah. But I'm also, you know, working on writing stuff. Wait. Outlining your book? I feel like I'm so behind for NaNoWriMo. But at the same time, I also feel okay. But I'm just, uh, I'm, I can't even decide what this one character's name is yet. But I know the character. Like, I know who he is and what he's going to be doing. And that kind of thing. And like, what he means to the story. But I don't know his name yet, and I can't figure it out. I told him to give him an in name for now, just like a placeholder name. And for it to be something stupid like Flame or something really dumb. Because that way you can't just like give him a mediocre name, and then you just kind of leave it. Because you're like, oh, I can't think of anything better. If you give him a really, really crappy name, then you'll be forced to change it in the second draft. I just I want to go in, <laughs> I want to go into it with a, a name because I feel like it's important for him to have a name for some reason I don't know I've all the other characters are named I have names for everybody so far and I've pretty much figured out the whole plot I just need to actually finish outlining it and just I've I have so much stuff on my mind right now a lot of it and just like NaNoWriMo and reading and booktube videos and vlogs and trying to wake up early in the morning and trying to make more food at night even though that hasn't really happened and 
want to do this kind of stuff, and there's a lot. There's a lot to think about right now, but that's not really anything new, so. We were watching some of the old vlogs, both of us, and they're pretty awful. <laughs> Can't believe you guys actually wanted to watch those. <laughs> we were, like, talking about how awkward they were and how terrible the filming was a lot of the time, and the editing wasn't very good either. Like, I, I want to say you should, oh, when when the year is over, you should all go back and, like, rewatch it from the beginning, or we should go back and rewatch it from the, from the beginning, but I don't want to force that on you. <laughs> I don't want to make you have to do something like that. Yeah, they I'm were... so sorry they were so bad, but hopefully they've gotten a little bit better, and maybe they'll get even better someday when we get a better vlog camera and now that we know what we're doing more and that kind of thing. Yeah, but... as somebody who doesn't really pay attention to editing, I can definitely say that your editing has improved. Yeah. <laughs> a lot. Yeah. I mean, like, that makes sense, because it's something that you're doing every day, and... Yeah, I mean, I didn't really... This is just... I've come into a certain kind of flow with my editing. And you're a lot faster now. now. And I'm faster, and I can... Yeah, I can just... I know more of what I'm trying to do with it. So, anyway. But I guess that's pretty much it for today. Today, I washed my hair. And that's all I did. But that was, that was a big step. I did one more, like, color strip, so... I think it's looking pretty blonde, so... It is. I can't see very much pink anymore. Yeah. It's still a tiny bit pink when it's yeah. wet, especially, but I think I'm going to try a toner sometime this week or next week, so I'm pretty excited. But it's very frizzy right now because it keeps sticking all that crap on my hair to, like, get the color out, so... Mm -hmm. I'm just going to deep condition a lot, and then I can tone it, which will probably kill it again, but <laughs> it's fine. Anyway, I guess that's it, so we'll see you tomorrow.